Welcome back. We'd like to stand up for the little guys on this show, and today that means literally standing up for the little guys against Hugh Grant. First, he took the sole role as an Oompa Loompa in the new Wonka movie, depriving dwarf actors uh, of their chance at a coveted role. And he has had the audacity to whine about it, moaning about everything, about the facial cameras used by animators. It's like a crown of thorns, he wailed. Very uncomfortable. I made a big fuss about it. I couldn't have hated the whole thing more. I slightly hate making films, but I have lots of children and need money. Meanwhile, he said he's too old and fat and ugly to star in romantic comedies, which is actually the first time he and I have ever agreed about anything he's ever said. But returning to the show now is Dylan Postle, who's also known by his wrestling ring name, Hornswoggle. Dylan, great to have you back on Uncensored. I thought about you hey, immediately. Bruce. I saw Hugh Grant moaning about the role that he played as an Oompa Loompa, because not only did he take a role that should have been for an actor like you, but he then complained about it. What was your reaction? I, I don't, I, I fully don't understand why he's complaining about it. He knew what he was getting into when he accepted the role. He, he, he obviously knew. So if there was any thought in his mind that there would be a backlash or whatnot, um, even himself feeling that way, why take the role in the first place? Whether it's the production crew uh, asking him to do the role, he should have then if there was any question of it, should have not accepted the role. Right. Now, the president of Little People of America, Mark Povanelli, said the most troubling aspect of the Hugh Grant situation is that, from what I can tell, they have CGI'd him to have the physical attributes of a person with dwarfism, like the larger arms and shorter hands, so he looks like a person with achondroplasia, just like the Oompa Loompas from the film of the early 70s. They're trying to maintain yes. the physicality of dwarfism, but erase the authenticity of dwarfism, which is troubling. And that's why you go, well, this is like a physical version of blackface. Would you agree with that? I, I wouldn't go that far. Well, um, what do you I, think? I have achondroplasia myself. I have achondroplasia myself. Uh, this is kind of going back to the the CGI or the uh, normal size actors in the Seven Dwarves roles, where it's taking roles from um, the dwarf community, from my, my community, and giving them to average size actors when those roles for my community are very few and far between. So when roles like the Oompa Loompa or the Seven Dwarves are really key roles for people like me, it's a, it's a really a, a, a kick in the guts and, and it's, a, it's, a, it's a hard pill to swallow. It really is. And of course so it comes... To then... I'm sorry, I was going to say, it's very hypocritical for hi because we've seen time and again yeah. Hollywood stars standing up and saying only gay uh, actors can play gay roles, only disabled actors can play disabled roles, uh, only trans actors can play trans roles, and so on. It seems like you're the only group who do not have Hollywood's protection in that regard. That's, a, a, yeah, I, I just don't understand. Um, <laughs> especially now you're, you're, you're spending the extra money on CGI and on uh, edits and all of that when there are actors such as myself um, and other dwarves out there that would have loved this role, I'm sure. Um, I would have loved it, obviously. Uh, I'm, I'm trying to do more acting and more, more roles, whether it be dwarf roles or normal size roles. So for me, it would have been an absolute dream role. Um, it's, it's all in, in nowadays how it's viewed, and I understand completely how the Oompa Loompas maybe have been viewed uh, in current day compared to in the past. But it's just, I, 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 these are roles that were made for people like me. 